Yo, what is good fam? It's your boy Swift. We're going to be jumping in today with God Key and I'm just kind of bored. I wanted to use Blue Boys and just kind of check in, see how they're doing. Um, so we're going to throw them on this God Key setup alongside Kaio Ken and the Zenkai Green Vegeta. Um, and he is getting, and Blue Boys are getting Zenkai buffed. So yeah, without further ado, let's go ahead and jump in. Uh, this dude's got a pretty stacked god key team. Unfortunate. Okay. Alright, I will take that. Ooh, very unfortunate. Oh, he doesn't capitalize on the PV. Ah, nice play, nice play. Got him with a single tap. Right, good. We can start healing up a little bit here. Pick up another round of card draw speed. Ah, he reduces my key, though. Um, I think I'm just going to go ahead and rush. Get rid of somebody here. Okay. You guys all ready for MUI to come out? <laughs> he's gonna be here. Uh, he's gonna be here before we know it. Ouch! That's gonna hurt. Ooh, got him in the sidestep. It's not gonna kill, but we'll do some hefty damage here for sure. Yep. And he's dead. Oh, he's not dead. Damn. This Kaioken is a tanky, tanky boy. Okay. Well, now he's dead. This is fine. This is fine. I basically just don't want to let him kill green vegeta somehow nice nice Ooh, unfortunate. Very unfortunate. I should still be okay. Oh, he was ready for it. He was ready for that. Ooh, that's game. That is game. GG's, man. That was actually a pretty crazy match. Match. 
Alright, we got somebody from the Kaizen Guild. Should be a good one. He goes double red. Nice. I don't have any key. Please sidestep for me. Pretty please. Yes. Get that vanish back. Ooh, he's dead. Wait. Let's go, let's go, blue boys. Let's go, blue boys. Got him in the sidestep. Like, I'll easily admit that blue boys are not nearly as good as they used to be, but dude, they can still pack a punch, man. You play right, you play the right way with them, they can do some damage. Alright, we got a GT team. Unfortunate. I just wanted to see what he would do right there, and clearly he did not sidestep. Okay, I've got him at the tackle tech. Oh, he's not going to swap out right there. I mean, I really had no reason to drop combo. I just thought he was going to swap out. Got him in the sidestep. I'm just going to immediately get the damage. I don't know if this is the right play. I could have just tried to play around with some drop combos. But I'd rather just secure damage. That was some pretty good damage, too. Got him in the sidestep. Alright, what's he going to do now? He goes into Gogeta. Okay. Ooh, PV. I'm going to swap because I know he's going to switch. Yep. Figured it was worth it to get the card draw speed. Man, it still feels good playing with blue boys. I'm not going to lie. They're just a fun unit. And that's probably why a lot of people like 17 and 18 as well. Because these dual units are pretty fun to play with. I'm not going to lie. Can they be annoying to fight? Yeah, sometimes. But I will admit they are pretty fun to play with. And we're obviously talking, you know, five, six months after Blue Boys have already came out, or four or five months. Um, imagine, you know, the day they came out, they were just ridiculous back then. I had a feeling he was going to rush right there. All right, this is going to be a dead Gogeta. I'm pretty sure we can deal with um, Shenron. But yeah, I'm having fun with them right now, honestly. Seventeen and eighteen are like just literally better in every single way, but I'm still having fun with Blue Boys. Part of me wishes I low-key summon for seventeen and eighteen, but at the same time, with anniversary so close, and I try really not to spend too much money. Nice, got him here. Um, I I just figured I would skip seventeen and eighteen and save for anniversary. So, and they announced the MUI Goku, so I'm happy. Alright, this is a very tough, tough team to deal with. 17 and 18 on LOE. Very tough team to deal with. Yeah, we'll take that though. I will take that. It's actually decent damage. Holy cow. Oh, holy cow. Got him with the tackle tech. Dude, that dam this damage from Blue Boys right off the bat is uh, pretty impressive. I'm not going to lie. I'm going to drop combo. I'm, I feel like he's going to go to Frieza. Or actually, no. Let's just hit him with the blue. Uh, 
Unfortunate. I shouldn't have wasted Kaokin's Vanish. Yeah. Now I'm kind of backed into a corner. Ooh, he was ready for it. Okay. Okay, this guy knows what's up. This guy knows what's up. This is fine. We can heal. Let's go to Green Vegeta. I'm out of that. Let's go into Kaioken. Okay, that's a long animation, luckily for me. Ah, uh, dude, why didn't I pop my main ability? If I would have popped my main ability right there, I would have been fine. And, ah, uh, dude, I'm late. Ah, uh, not popping the main right there really screwed me over. That was my fault. I 100% should have popped that main ability, and I would have been immune to cover change. Now I'm probably just going to eat a rush. Oh, he doesn't rush? Does he not have it? He's got to have his rush. That sucks. Maybe he wants to save it for Kaioken or Green Vegeta. I'm not sure. Let's see if he rushes. If he rushes, it is what it is. Can't control it. I want to kind of try to showcase Blue Boys if I can. Oh, okay. Green card. He could still rush. Yep, there's the rush. All right. It is what it is. I still blame it on myself for not popping uh, Kyle Ken's main ability. Let's see if we can uh, 2v3 come back here. I have faith in Blue Boys, man. If I can just get a priority with them, I can start healing and get that card draw speed and kind of get the ball rolling with them a little bit. But this is not going to be easy. Nice. Very nice. Um, I am going to rush. That's fine. Just wanted to get rid of somebody. Didn't really care who it was. Nice. Yeah. In a situation like this, I don't really care who I rush as long as I get it down to 2v2. Because as long as it's 2v3, I'm just permanently at a disadvantage because I have less vanishes. You know? No! Oh, my, dude, if I would have just stayed at mid-range, I feel like I could have reacted to that blast card and popped the ultimate. I think floating up close range was not the play right there. Wait, does he even have enough to kill? Yeah, he can go into, yeah, he can go into droids. Alright, gotta rely on Kaioken. Nice. I mean, to be honest, I don't see myself coming back from this. There's a very small chance, but I doubt it. I did that on purpose because I need time to draw these greens. Or pop these greens. Nice. Back float. Game priority. Let me see if I can get my vanish back here somehow. I need to start filling up that gauge. Okay, I actually have a chance here. Hold up. Hold up. The problem is, is if I lose priority one time, I lose. I think. No! Oh my dude, I should have waited for him to sidestep in mid-range. I think this is just game. Can I sur- I think I can survive, right? Oh, nope, I'm dead. <laughs> well, GG's man, that was a phenomenal game. This guy's good, man. I played him the other day. Um, I think the last time I played him, I won, but I, like, barely won. So, every single time I've matched this dude, it's a, it's a really good match. So, definitely GG's. And I actually have another team composition, like, a different team for a different video that I'm working on. So, I'm going to go ahead and end the video here. And I'm going to uh, work on this next video I'm going to upload maybe, you know, later in the day or tomorrow or something like that. But yeah, either way, thank you guys so much for stopping by and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.